testing the environmental Kuznets curve hypothesis in SMAC countries. This article is written by three authors. First author Philemon Siela. Second author Jean Felix Mabiella. Last author Louis Bertram Mogla Ikinda. Contribution and originality of the study is that, this paper contributes to the literature on environmental economics by verifying the existence of the environmental Kuznets curve in SMAC countries. In addition, we have determined the per capita income thresholds from which the evolution of CO2 emissions changes in concavity using estimation techniques such as FMOLs and fixed effects. The objective of the study is to test the hypothesis of the environmental Kuznet curve, EKC, for six SMAC countries covering the period 1960 to 2014. We wanted to know if the evolution of per capita income affects environmental quality in the income emissions relationship environment. To achieve this objective, we use the method of fixed effects. The results of this study reveal that there is no empirical support for the presence of an environmental Kuznets curve hypothesis. On the other hand, there is a rather an inverted in-shaped relationship between gross domestic product per capita and CO2 emissions. Moreover, the use of the FMOLS method gives robust results. For this purpose, the minimum turning point which corresponds to per capita income from which CO2 emissions increase is $89.84 and the maximum point corresponding to per capita income from which CO2 emissions decreases is $116.21. Therefore, SMAC countries must undertake income policies with the aim of reaching at least the threshold of $1,116.21 per capita in order to reverse the evolution of CO2 emissions. Thanks for watching this video of Asian Journal of Empirical Research Volume 12 Issue Number 2.